I am absolutely in awe over the kerfuffle over ChatGPT3, or as I like to call it, the G. The G, like the email, the facsimile, the interwebs, and the abacus, is merely but a tool that we can use to help us do our jobs better, more effectively, more efficiently. But where it all falls apart is when we have the expectations of it, that it's the be all and end all of everything that we need to solve humanity's largest problems. It's just a tool and it'll help you become a better writer, a better coder, help you do any of your jobs very much more efficiently. If we have the courage to look at it as merely but a tool. It's sad reading these headlines in Australian newspapers the other day that leading educational institutions are banning tools like this. But when you dig deeper into the article, a bigger problem emerges. All these academic leaders out there are struggling to understand the technology, so it's safer for them to just blanket ban it, which is very sad. But for those of you out there who actually get curious about these technologies, because there are more coming, play with the technology. Invite a subject matter expert into your organization who knows about technology and get them to share these cool tools with you and get them to show you how to play with them so that you can figure out for yourselves how to use them to do your jobs more effectively and more efficiently. I hope this tip serves you to embrace technology rather than hide away and ban it.